very exciting things happening as you and women will share to all of us the country program priorities. So on behalf of UN Women, we work on promoting global norms and standards around gender equality and women's empowerment. So here in the Philippines, many of you have been part of or will know the programs we've done, such as working on violence against women. And I'm also proud because it involves bringing different UN agencies together to really see how we can better serve. And we finally arrived at a framework that we think is a doable and part of the theory of change in doing this plan is that we begin where the women are. And that's what we want to see for women and girls here in the Philippines, to have that freedom and dream to decide, to have that opportunity for them to really become what they want to be without any worry or fear, and that their voice and their contributions are being counted and being considered when decisions are made, and that those contributions they would benefit and enjoy. So I started with you and women in 2020 as a volunteer. We started with Agapay Nanay with Len, and this was Typhoon Ulysses. The, the people who are here today, I'm just so grateful when people show up, it's a sign of love. So let's not take that for granted, all right? First, as a Goodwill Ambassador, it's such a pleasure to work. It's all about the work. So I believe by amplifying STEM, it's to ensure that they are mentored into a STEM-related workplace. So we are starting with 10 UN Women She STEMs Awards for the year. Other than the She STEMs Awards is on a long-term project, we do hope to do this. This is the Women Leadership Coaching and Mentoring Program that will connect women in far-flung areas to successful women in the corporate world in different industries and make sure that they will be able to fly higher. Ito yung mga babae na, what is stopping her from succeeding? I have a bias in favor of women. Yeah. We're an all-women team. But I felt that I had to reach out more to women to ensure that our laws are not just funded, but actually implemented. And I will not stop until I see the positive impact on the sustainable income of our women. Part of actually empowering our girls is to give them that information so they can be in charge of their body, they can be in charge of their lives. It's so important to open doors for other women because not everyone has access to mentorship or the connections or opportunities. That's the best way to start empowering women. We need you and we need everyone's commitment. We need you to champion this work for women and girls. We cannot be leaving half of the population behind.